I'm going to give you a little demonstration of how EFT works. We're going to tap a few times on each of the spots that are meridians to different organs in your body. And the place that we're going to start is right here. It's, it's between your eyebrows, right above your eyebrow, anywhere in here is good. So you can use one hand. Some people use both hands and tap on both, right above both eyebrows. Okay, That's okay too. I tend to use one hand and tap very gently. If you're extra sensitive, which I am, sometimes this feels too violent. And I will tap a couple times and then I might just hold it there. Okay, That's okay. You need to judge when it feels too much for you. If it's too intense, then back down and maybe just hold the spot, okay? There's no right or wrong here. You can't make a mistake with it, but I want you to be comfortable. It should not hurt at all, okay? So I tap here, the eyebrow point, it's called. There's a point here right at the side of your eye, okay, at your temple. And we're gonna tap there a few times. And again, if you're sensitive, maybe tap once and then hold it. There's a spot here that's very sensitive and it is below the eye, that soft spot on your cheek, right? Okay, that's where you wanna tap, okay? And this, this point, definitely you wanna do it softly, okay? The next point is right here under the nose. And you may just wanna use one finger here to tap. Okay. And then we're gonna tap here in your chin right here okay and you can use one or two fingers and you can tap very gently okay then the collarbone tapping either one side or both sides right here at the collarbone okay and this one it usually can take a stronger tap okay but you judge how you feel here okay but you can also just do it on the sternum okay so the collarbone is great and we don't hit every point every round if you don't want to, okay? There's one other important spot though, and it's the top of the head, the crown of the head. And you can tap, some people tap right in the center and it's enough vibration to reach out and go where it needs to go. Um, I tap lightly, sort of in a circle on the top of my head again, because I don't like the really hard tapping. Okay. And then at the end of the rounds that I will do with you, we're gonna tap on the ends of the fingers. It's good to know that there are meridians here, so if you are in a meeting and you don't want to be doing this but you're feeling stressed, you can just tap on your fingers under the table and it's actually going to help you bring your stress levels down and shift your emotional body and your vibration very quickly. Okay, so tapping on the end of each finger is great. The side of the hand is another one. Okay, you can tap there and then squeezing the wrist also activates it and this is a reminder to you to take that deep breath at the end of every round this is the most important part is taking a deep breath in and then release that out breath helps you let go and clear it out of your energy field so i want a big whoosh okay make some noise when you breathe on that a couple other pointers about tapping is that the speed doesn't matter so much it's just at least activating this area that you feel it, that you feel the connection between your fingers and that point, okay? So some people, again, are a little harder headed and maybe they need to tap a little longer. We also don't know where we're holding the emotion and that's why we cover all of them. We don't know if it's, if it's wrapped up in our stomach, but you may know that you get knots in your stomach. So this point may, you may actually feel a shift when you're tapping here, if you're a very stomach holder of, of those emotions, right? Okay, so each of those points, I don't want you to worry about the meridians and where it goes though. I want you to just know you can cover every part of your body by circulating your tapping. Okay, so now that we have covered all the different spots you can use, pay attention to how it feels. Is there a location that feels more soothing to you? Go ahead and do that more often. Okay? A lot of people use the points on the fingers, which cover most of the meridians, also because it's more convenient and less crazy, right? To be tapping all over your body. So listen to your body and do what works for you. Don't worry about making sure you tap equal amount on every point. 
Again, be sensitive and know this is to make you feel better.